This video compares the Coachman Prism up against the Winnebago View and Itasca Navi. On the first thing you'll notice is that the full body paint does not extend onto the cab like it does on the Winnebago View and Itasca Navion, which gives you a more attractive look and also provides you with a front protective mask protecting the front of your coach from rock chips, bugs. This is not available in the Coachman Prism. The next thing we'll look at is the slide room awning. It does not fully protect the slide seals due to where they are mounted on the slide itself. You'll notice that the Coachman Prism uses black plastic doors to conceal several compartments on the exterior of the coach, unlike the Winnebago where the fiberglass compartment doors coordinate with the rest of the coach. This photo will show you duct tape that is keeping the black water tank probes in place. Winnebago uses true level ultrasonic monitoring systems on the exterior of the coach, giving you true and accurate readings. This is showing us the running boards that are connected to the body of the coach, which can cause future damage from the flexing movement as you travel down the road. The Coachman only uses one house battery, where Winnebago, it comes standard with two house batteries, giving you extra power and more reliability. The Coachman Prism with full body paint uses an, a vinyl awning which can create a greenhouse effect when you have a full body paint on your coach. Winnebago uses a metal wrapped acrylic fabric for safe breathing. As you can see here, the entry door is only 22 inches, where in the Winnebago it's 26 inches. This is the screen door on the Coachman Prism. As you can see, it's very thin. Uh, Winnebago screen doors are made in-house by Capco and are very strong and reliable. Coachman also doesn't label their light switches, unlike Winnebago, whose light switches are labeled so that you can easily turn on and off the lights that you wish. Right here, we're looking at the cab seat that does not swivel. Unlike the Winnebago and the Itasca Navion, they do swivel around so that you can use it as livable um, seating space. As you can see here in this photo, this is the L-shaped sofa. It's configured rather awkwardly not allowing for additional comfortable seating. You'll also notice in the cab area here, there are no cab window blinds. Winnebago uses cab window blinds that uh, closes off your front window so that you can still have your cab space livable. The Winnebago Itasca has a radio selector switch so that you can dedicate your radio to either your engine or house batteries when dry camping, where the Coachman Prism does not. The glove box in the Coachman Prism does not have a lock on it. In the Winnebago and Itasca, it does have a lock on the lockbox. The Coachman Prism also does not feature fitted, removable cab carpet. In the Winnebago View and Itasca, it does have this feature. You'll also notice that Coachman doesn't put serial numbers on their parts where Winnebago does for easy replacements. If you have any questions, please call 1-800-343-6255.